What's up everybody? My name is Papa Wizard 100 and welcome to my first episode of Pokemon Red Nuzlocke! That's right, I got a real Pokemon Red cartridge right here, ready to be played. And a real limited edition, one of a lifetime offer. This is the Pokemon Red Charmander Game Boy Advance SP. It has a print of Charmander on it. You can totally see it, it's totally not fake. Alright, let's do this! So, apparently this copy of Pokemon Red is fried because the person who owned it before tried a bunch of glitches and it didn't work correctly. Now it's fried. So I guess we're going to the emulator. Kill the intro! Hello everyone, Pop the Weasel 100 here, and welcome to my first Nuzlocke challenge and let's play for Pokemon. Now, I started really liking Pokemon, like really, really liking Pokemon, and this is giving me some audio issues, so let's just lower that a little bit. But I am a huge fan of Pokemon now. Not like a huge fan, but yeah, you can see it says Nuzlocke version. Hack is in the description if you want to play play this. It's basically just a Pokemon Red hack, but with Nuzlocke rules. So you have to deal with the whole fact of having to deal with your death. With Pokemon dying. So I'm going to just go ahead and start this. But before we do, if you don't know the Nuzlocke rules, I'll go ahead and give you a little overview. And you should probably watch other Nuzlocke's, because this is a very unprofessional run. I haven't actually really played through Red. So it's sort of blind. So let's go, just go ahead and say. So, rules for Nuzlocke. First of all, if a Pokemon is dead, if a Pokemon faints, they are considered dead and you have to release them. No exceptions. I, however, will have an exception with the fact that if your starter Pokemon dies, I will have a safe state to continue the Nuzlocke. Because we aren't just going to have this, have the first Pokemon we encounter, we, the first Pokemon we get, the starter, die and then we never do this because I want to upload this if that was the case. Second one is that you can only catch a Pokemon in one area and if you kill said Pokemon the first Pokemon that you can catch is in the first ah this is really hard to word if you the only Pokemon you can catch are the first ones in each new route if you kill that Pokemon you can't get any others so that's the thing and man this is giving me some audio issues let me go ahead and options sound okay whatever cut that out so now that I've described the rules some other rules that I will be using is I, will, I am allowed to use items in battle as long as my Pokemon are in red health like very very low health so if my Pokemon is outside said health I will not use items even if it will be very likely that your Pokemon will die. And the battle formation will be changed, will be set to shift, so it's not incredibly unfair. Alright, let's start. New game. So in the intro that I showed earlier, I'm not going to even try. Most people know about this. Good old Pokemon prof. And here's a uh, Nidorino, I think. I'm pretty sure that's Nidorino. But the reason why I I am doing this on an emulator. All right, first of all, what is my name? Have Red, Ash, Jack, and new name. I'm going to name myself Soda, cause Pop Soda Soda Pop. Wait, not Sodo. Soda. All caps, because that's the Pokemon tradition. Alright, so my name is Soda, and here is our rival. I don't know what his name is, so let's give him a name. Alright, his name is going to be... Hmm. This 
is a tough decision for Nuzlocke. All right, let's just go. Let's just go ahead and name him. Uh, I got it. Murida. It's uh, basically an informal way of saying impossible in Japanese. So let's go ahead and start. Alright. So as I was saying before, the intro is real. My Pokemon cartridge is in fact fried. So anytime a text box pops up, it gives me an error and yeah I really need to set up these sound issues that's even worse okay Yeah, it's much better. Alright, so, yeah, my Pokemon cartridge is fried. Every single time a text box opened, it would turn off the system. It would, like, completely freeze the game. My Game Boy SP, like, gave it different things. It made everything random. Like, sometimes it would play an item. Sometimes it would even go into a battle. And you can see footage of that on Miss Happy Novel's channel. Search for a haunted Pokemon red cartridge. And, yeah, so... Yeah, and the intro was supposed to be terrible. So let's go ahead and start. Professor, okay, wait, don't go out. And he just he just spawned on the bottom left. I never actually noticed that. I love how you need a Pokemon if you ever want to go outside. It's beautiful. So now we're gonna go ahead. And... I wish I was, I wish I could speed this up, but. And this hack, what this hack does is instantly erase your Pokemon if they die, so... It's actually pretty, pretty good for Nuzlocke, because sometimes I forget to get rid of Pokemon. Alright, so... Oh, I really should have gotten... Alright. I am going. Two. Flip a bottle cap here, and if it lands on its nice side, it will be Bulbasaur. If it lands on its full side, it will be Squirtle, and if it lands on the empty side, it will be Charmander. So basically, empty side Charmander, flat side Squirtle, on its side, no, on its side Squirtle, flat side Bulbasaur. So, it landed on its flat side. So, we get Bulbasaur. I actually haven't ever used the Bulbasaur, so... Wait, oh, this is Charmander. No. Alright, so... Bulbasaur. Alright, I got a Bulbasaur, my first Pokemon. Alright, let's give it a nickname. This is the moment of truth. What is my starter going to be named? It's going to be named... Pookie. Pookie gone. Pookie gone. That's funny. Boink, puke gone. <laughs> I didn't mean for it to actually say that. Alright, so. It's the only time I'm going to use a save state. So, let's go ahead and save. Simply because I don't want to have to restart this whole game. And to fight red, blue again. His name is Blue. No, actually, wait. His name was... Mureda. Right. Namsoda. Alright, so. First Pokemon battle. Ugh. I just hope he uses Growl a bunch. I don't even know what happens when, uh... 
He lives against this right. Oh wow. Ridiculous. I never like the starter battles in this. Ooh, critical hit, nice. And I'm dead. I wonder what happens. Yeah, it says Puka Gun died. Did I do I even have any Pokemon or am I in the Safari Safari Ball mode? Let's see. Oh no. Fuga gone is right there. Okay, never mind. I guess I never needed a safe state. Oh well. Well, I guess we're starting off. Alright, Fuga gone. Let's go. Alright, so. The catch one Pokemon in our area doesn't apply here considering I need to get Pokeballs and I haven't gotten any Pokeballs yet. So, this will sort of just be for level grinding. So any of these like regular Pokemon, I don't have to worry about them. And once I get Pokeballs, I'll be able to actually like get somewhere. Because we're first Pokemon, so Pokeball so yeah, the catch in first route the first one you catch in the first route does not apply. That rule does not apply here due to the fact that I don't have any Pokeballs. Makes sense. Oh, wow. So far, the random encounter have been pretty frequent. I don't want to lose in the beginning, so I'm going to be running away from a couple of battles. Yeah, it's helpful. Now, if you could please move. Is this copy rigged or something? Because I'm getting like tons of random battles and I don't even want to. Alright. Let's run. Oh, and this emulator I'm using is called BGB. It doesn't really actually emulate uh, Super Game Boy, but it does give the color palette and stuff. Alright, so. Right, I was supposed to go to Pokemon Mart. Order. We never. Even oh wait, it was those prototype Pokeballs, right? Right, it was that po prototype Pokeballs. That's kind of weird, but whatever. I need to heal my Pokemon. Now, on my verdict to Pokemon, I've been really enjoying Twitch Plus Pokemon Anniversary Crystal or Shattered Crystal. It's been really fun, specifically because I like Pokemon. But Pokemon Crystal is my favorite because it has so many complex ideas. It has a day and night system that I don't think many other games actually captivated. I think that was the only one that did, unless the later generations one did. Later generations did. Whatever, Pokemon is weird. I was never allowed to play it when I was a kid. And again, I don't think a lot of kids were. Well, there probably were a lot of kids who were allowed, but. Okay, one step in the grass and the random encounter. Oh, well, I'll beat up this Pidgey. It's level 2 anyway. So, I love po I like Pokemon. I just don't like the regular verses. And my ears are scratchy. Hold on. There we go. Alright, boom. Pukegon, Pukegon, it's doing pretty good. Alright. So. I don't have much to talk about for Pokemon. This will get more entertaining when I start getting high level Pokemon. But right now, it's just very meh. So I guess... Just nothing. I got nothing.
And now I have the Pokedex, so that's good. Ah, <sighs> Gary. No, wait, Blu-Ray-Da. I keep forgetting his name. It should... It's always Blu-Ray-Da. But if you want to watch more entertaining those vlogs, <laughs> the Pro Jerry's Pokemon Red one isn't too bad. Then I got a town map. So Gary said, hey, I'll not... Hey, don't lend him a map. She's just like, alright. And completely averts that. Alright. Now I have... I have Pokeballs, right? No, I do not. I guess I get them in the store? I thought in all the Pokemon games you started with. You got them after you gave the parcel to Professor Oak. Guess not here. I'm gonna be doing a lot of running away from Pokemon unless they're level 2. Thank you. That guy is so slow in just turning around. Are you level 2? No, you are level 3. I'm going to run then. Cool. Alright, cool. Now I'll be able to get Pokeballs and actually do stuff. For once. And hopefully I'll have more Pokemon and I'll actually have a better team. Right, I'm gonna focus on buying. Eight Pokeballs and actually I'm gonna buy more. There we go, fifteen. All my money's worth. I can get a potion from the PC, I think, unless I was added in the remakes. I have to go to the Pokemon Center anyway. Oh, I was in the game. That's that's wonderful. Alright, so now I have a potion, just in case my Pokemon get low, low on health. Alright, so. Now this is done. Let's catch our first Pokemon. And then we'll end this part. What's our first Pokemon gonna be? Let's find out! It is a Rattata! Alright! Oh, it's level 2 though. Well, hopefully I don't instantly kill it. If I do, it's gonna be Pukagon for a little while. If it had Growl, I could probably risk using another, but alright. Cut the Rattata! Alright, let's give a nickname to it. It's going to be known as... Wendo. That sounds fun. <laughs> Alright. So, just head into the Pokemon Center, and we'll end the episode here. Might as well just go ahead and say, thanks for watching. If you want to subscribe, you can to see more of this Nuzlocke. Hopefully it will go absolutely fine, and not absolutely terrible like I expect it to. And I'll see you in the next video. So, take care. And also here are some other videos.